just his fourth ever MMA fight. Brock Lesnar is a destructive force and a true titan of MMA. Brock Lesnar started out. Well, look at this. That's some serious power. Number 8. Royce Gracie. Surprised? Don't be. If we're basing our list on criteria such as godlike and influential, then Royce Gracie belongs here in the list of titans of MMA. Royce Gracie proved that fighters don't need to be powerful when he brought a relatively unproven martial arts at the time into the cage at UFC 1. Royce Gracie brought the style of Gracie Jiu-Jitsu to mixed martial arts and changed the game forever. At the time, if you were tuning in to watch cage fighting, you'd hands down bet on the bigger and stronger guy. Unless Royce Gracie was in the cage, every other fighter in the sport was trying to work out how to stop the winner and stop the guy who was submitting every opponent to Joe Sane had never seen before. Royce Gracie fans can get the victories in the game as soon as you can see the victory in the game. The game is not a 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 game. 记住微信：三五八幺六三三七九。Chuck Liddell was another one of the fighters who brought MMA into mainstream sports. He was also one of the first true knockout artists we'd ever seen in the UFC. A couple years ago, if you asked anyone what they thought a UFC fighter looked like, they'd picture someone along the lines of Chuck Liddell. The mohawk and tattoos on the side of the head were intimidating even to those sitting cage side. Chuck Liddell was named the Iceman because he could put people to sleep with his knockout power. Many even associated the phrase sprawl and brawl with Chuck Liddell because he would stop your takedowns and then smash your face with punches. Liddell was unbreakable. He entered the cage with a knockout or get knocked out mentality. Chuck Liddell is the definition of tight. Who do you think will be number one on the list of greatest titans of MMA? Number 6. BJ Penn BJ Penn, the Hawaiian prophet.